Ty Majeski will lead him as he approaches the restart zone. Christian Eckes on the outside. Green flag is in the air. We are racing at Martinsville. Eckes is hanging there. Look at Eckes hard down in the corner. Had a good angle getting in the corner. And is it a good angle exiting too? And he's going to clear the 98 of Majeski, or is he? What a start. Yes, he does. Christian Eckes takes control of the lead here. Ty Majeski back in the second. Corey Heim back there in third. Jack Wood just got around the 71 there of Raja. And then behind him, there's Caden Honeycutt heating up that 71. Looks like he's slipping, Jamie. Yes, and just listening in on the radio, Raja was saying that he needs more drive. And his spotter, Joe Campbell, was telling him, just work on opening up your entry a little bit. That's going to help yourself out a little bit before we can make it to pit lane to make some changes. They're looking for a good run. There's a lot of new things going over there on over there at Rackley War Racing. And, oh, got a truck around. That's the 46. That's Thad Moffitt. Caution is out now for the first time this evening. I think we have to get rolling so we don't get lapped to get here. So Christian Eckes will lead him here. Ty Majeski on the outside and stacks him up in the outside just a little bit. You see Corey Heim got in the back of the 98. Yeah, second start in a row that uh, the 98 was a little bit. Oh, Jack, Jack Wood. Jack Wood off the track on the inside. He keeps can it he rolling. Can he it around? Keeps it rolling. You can see Lane Riggs in that 38 trying to get that second position away. Look at this battle for second. Lane Riggs more comfortable here on the short tracks. Was so happy to be here today in that 38 truck. And you can hang there for a couple laps on the outside. Good exit for... Wow. Majeski is going to be able to drive down in front of the 38. He is. He's clear. That 98 is strong. Christian Eckes works his way around. Looking to pick up his second stage win of 2024. Ty Majeski behind him, Lane Riggs, Corey Heim, Nick Sanchez, Ben Rhodes, Tyler Ingram, Jake Garcia, Caden Honeycutt, and Chase Purdy. Picks up the 10th spot. Christian Eckes on the older tires. Nick Sanchez, oh, stacks him up on the restart line side by side. You see him ducking all around. Chase Purdy back there in the 77. That was a nice dive bomb by Chase Purdy. He was able to catch Caden Honeycutt hanging on the outside. Sanchez gets over. Honeycutt's now stuck up top. And I'm not sure that Sanchez spun the tires or maybe had a little bit of help from Honeycutt because right at the start finish line, he dove left, but again, I'm. It was either spinning the tires or had some help doing it. Dives down into turn three. Oh. Got Tanner Gray around the 88, stopped on the racetrack. He gets it going. And they all get going. All your tires up? Yep. They're all yeah, up. Feels okay. Caution is out for the second time. Phil, seven of our top eight trucks have not been to pit road. Ready for restart, number two, Christian Eckes, Tyler Ankrum on the front row. Christian Eckes just nailing the initial start and both restarts so far tonight. Look at Chase Purdy up there in the 77, just behind Eckes. Tyler Ankrum trying to grab that second spot away. Caden Honeycutt with a strong run in that 45. He's Garcia so right impressive. behind. And that 13, a good top five run so far for Jake Garcia. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey Curry, William Sawalich. We didn't think he'd stay back there too long. They made some adjustments to that race truck up in the seventh spot now. Oh. Lane Riggs goes around. That brings out the caution for the third time. Lane's on the outside. Jack Wood down on the bottom. Did Jack slide up or did a shove from the back? Sammy, Sammy Smith. Smith. And did, you know, it's, it's interesting. If you're Jack Wood, you say, uh, I know I hit you, but somebody hit me. Yeah. All right, here we go. Christian Eckes. Chase Purdy on the outside. Tyler Ankrum just behind him. And the 45, Caden Honeycutt having a great night on the outside. Row number two, side by side, they go into turn one. Christian Eckes. Oh, Eckes squeezing Purdy up the hill. That's not going to set well with Purdy. See the sparks coming out from underneath the 77. Look at that. Dean Thompson making moves on the outside, trying to bring Taylor Gray along with him. Corey Heim picks up that 21st spot, gets around the 76 of Boyd. Remember, he last pitted on lap 79. Oh, oh no. And a tap from the 43 oh, Daniel Dye. Two Maybe trucks go around. Lane Riggs went around as well. Spencer Boyd, we were just talking about him. He goes around. What a night it's been for Lane Riggs. The green-white checker out. It's a Christian Eckes. He's led them all. 
picks up stage win number three on the season. How many times have we ever said that? First 100 laps. He let them all. He's let them all. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting ready to have his work cut out yeah, for him, yeah. though. He's going to come out in about 20th position, I would guess. Yeah, we, we can assure you that he will not lead every lap of this race. First time restarting on the front row tonight for William Sawalich on the outside. Nice and orderly into turn one. Ooh, nice move by Taylor Gray to grab that second spot. Solid restart by Ty Majeski, who has Taylor Gray just behind him. Nick Sanchez back there battling for that third spot. Do we give each other a little less room now, Michael, it's, in the second half? We're starting to really clamp down now, Phil. He has Ben Rose, the 99, to his outside. So Wallach is going to be able to duck over for a moment. And it's going to be contact. There it is. I saw the 71 jump in there. A little bit of contact. They all keep it straight. Yeah, That's Stewart made contact with Sawalich. Sawalich kept it straight. And there's Eckes. He's 13th, Phil. And you can see he's just heating up everybody he gets to. What a great grip he has up off the corner. You can see he just gets there, makes the move. Next up, Matt Crafton. They're just going to get progressively harder, though, to pass. Christian Eckes continues his march to the front. <laughs> a little love tap there to Corey Heim. He wants to take over that sixth spot. Corey not going to give it to him. Most everybody got to earn it. Definitely different strategies here as Ty Majeski, Taylor Gray lead him once again into turn one. I think the gloves are going to come off right now, Phil. I do, too. You can see. Sanchez big block by Sanchez on Taylor Gray Taylor took the block he didn't punt him out of the way Boy, look at that, that. turn did that truck turn in the center of the corner wow could be the most dominant truck I've seen here in a while he's just able to do things other guys Ooh. can't three wide the 43 what a night he has had and they're still crowding each other all over the place the five of Dean Thompson trying to get through he's been so solid all night match just now outside the top 15 Oh, oh, Ooh, man. that was a huge hit. What a bad break that was. Grant Enfinger straight into Dean Thompson. The caution comes out now for the seventh time tonight. Dean had no time to react to that contact. Look at that mm. tight short track racing. Look at the contact too. It's truck up off the ground. That's just destroyed that race truck. Certainly did. Ty Majeski. Been a great day for him. Can he hang on to the end? Nice start by Sanchez. And what happened to Majeski? Great restart by Nick Sanchez. Takes the lead for the first time tonight. Not quite. Ty Majeski coming back on the inside. They're battling back and forth. Here comes Eckes taking a peek. He moves into third. Nick Sanchez slips back. No more hold, but he takes it. Sanchez gets a little. Sideways, Christian Eck is behind him, got a little bit sideways and slips into third. Big block on the 17 of Taylor Gray for Christian Eckes. Matt Crafton remembering that bright yellow truck, just a little bit better tires. We saw him make that late pit stop, and he's making some good ground. Oh, we're Trucks wrecked. go around. Brett Holmes there in the 32. Wrecking again. And then 90, Justin Carroll in the wall. Caution comes out again. Real time look at it here. That was a big hit. It was. Pretty good launch right there for the 98. Nick Sanchez to the outside. Here comes Christian Eckes in the 19. There's that. He, there he is beside. Eckes is beside Sanchez. He's going to have position on him when they get down here to the corner. Moves him up the hill a little bit. And he gets it. Christian Eckes into the second spot. The caution going uh, to come out again. Four trucks around Jack Wood, this Cam Jake, Waters, yeah, Jake Garcia in the 13. Lawless truck. Allen, who avoided the last incident. Now he's involved with quite a bit of damage on the front of that truck. A lot of damage to the rear of Jack's truck as well. This is chain reaction. You can see started going bad up ahead of Raja. Nothing Daniel could do. He was just a victim of all that went down. Here we go. Christian Eckes has found his way back to the front. He starts outside. Ty Majeski, a big restart once again for Christian Eckes. Doesn't get clear. Nick Sanchez back there looking for that spot. Wants to take it over. 
The best two, two trucks two right here. Two. These were the best two all night long. Look at Majeski taking Ekus up the hill, but he's still hanging side by side. 27 laps to go. Christian Eck is trying to get cleared. Led the first 100 laps of this race. Ty Majeski not giving it up. Contact right there. Christian Eckes gets it, though. He takes the lead. They're in the 12th spot. Oh. And they go around again. Lane Riggs is around. There's Daniel Dye makes it through. The 66 has big issues now. That's Cam Waters. I think he might have. Water. I may, he may have run into the back of his teammate, Jake Garcia. He said Waters is spraying water, Jamie. I did say that. Well, you got to say stuff like that every now and then. Take a look at what brought out this caution. Hard so, to tell what happened to Riggs there. Looks like just a slight nudge by, by Grant in the nine truck. Restart once again. Christian Eck is a monster restart again. And a struggle again for Eckes, or excuse me, for Ty Majeski. Majeski, and he got hunted a little bit by Sanchez, but good, good tight racing up here in the front. And lost that second spot to Sanchez. Now Ankrum is side by side with Majeski for third. The 0-2, you see that orange truck top of your screen, Mason Massey, a great run for that 0-2 truck. Now running just outside the top 10 in 11th. That's great Ooh. to see. Trucks around once again, Stuart Friesen looks like he had trouble, but was able to hang on to it. The nine, a Grant end finger. <laughs> Look at all the smoke. Christian Eckes is like, come on, guys. Let's keep these things pointed in the right direction. I got, I got to bring this thing home. Will this be the last restart of the night? Christian Eckes, Nick Sanchez. Eckes every single time. Unbelievable on a, the reaction time on his restarts as they battle right behind him. The 98, Majeski trying to hang on. Not good enough. Eckes with the edge. Majeski comes back through turn three, turn four. They're battling. They're rubbing on each other right behind them. The 77 and Chase Purdy trying to get that third spot. He's led the most laps tonight. Christian Eckes hangs on to it coming out of turn four. What a perfect night it was. Eckes gets it done. He'll take on the grandfather clock at Martinsville. Let's go. <laughs> you win. Buddy. He went. Ty Majeski secures that second spot. Chase Purdy, great effort by him. And that's what victory feels like. Swept the whole race. Max points in both stages and gets the win. It's one of the straighter ones we'll have tonight. <laughs> yes, no doubt. Christian Eckes pumping the fist for those fans that stuck it out in this cold weather tonight. Hi, I'm Parker Kligerman. For more access like this from Pit Road, be sure to click and subscribe to the Motorsports and NBC YouTube channel.